everybody today we shall be looking into how main engine fuel oil system works as you can see on the screen is a layout of main engine fuel oil system the system comprises of fuel oil service tank three way valve fuel oil supply pump flow meter fuel oil circulating pump fuel oil heaters viscotherm auto backwash filter inlet manifold engine driven fuel pump fuel injectors return manifold mixing column pressure reducing valves and many other controllers fuel oil service tank is provided with a quick closing valve which you can shut off from a remote location in case of emergency let's open the quick closing valve and start the fuel oil supply pump number 1 look carefully what's happening the fuel flows through the filters number 1 supply pump flow meter and towards the circulating pump any pressure rise in the system will be regulated by the pressure reducing valve now let's start the fuel oil circulating pump number 1 yes you can see that the fuel continues to flow into the fuel oil heater to the viscoser which senses the viscosity of the fuel and maintains the same by regulating the steam through the heaters as required from the viscotherm the fuel passes on to the auto backwash filter and to the inlet manifold from the inlet manifold the fuel enters to the engine driven fuel pump and to the injectors through which the fuel is atomized into the combustion chamber with the help of the nozzle the excess fuel is returned to the return manifold and it flows into the mixing column which acts as a buffer tank for the excess fuel and it is recirculated in the system if there is any pressure rise in the system it will be released by the relief valve into the fuel oil service tank the air trapped in the system is released into the service tank by an automatic air release valve fitted on mixing column then from the service tank it is released to open atmosphere by venting i hope now you have got an idea of how the main engine fuel oil system works